Welcome back everyone to our weekly High Five, where we're gonna highlight five awesome things that are happening in the life of our church. So let's jump into it. Up at number five, law enforcement and faith institutions are key pillars of any community. They both exist to serve and support people in big ways. Well, this past weekend was National Faith in Blue Sunday, a day where local officers attend worship services to connect with community and be encouraged. It was a great day in Concord with officers attending our Concord Outpost for worship and a big luncheon. They even provided officers with teddy bears to give to children in need of comfort. This high five goes out to the Concord PD and the Concord Outpost for sharing God's love with their community. In at number four, recently our Celebrate Recovery group celebrated 15 years at one church. Celebrate Recovery is a Christ-centered 12-step program that meets weekly to help many people recovering from hurts, habits, and hang-ups. If you want more information about Celebrate Recovery, head to church.one slash groups today. Here at number three, recently our Franklin Outpost received a letter from the Franklin School District Superintendent thanking them for the donation of teacher bags to begin this school year. He said, it was great to see all the smiling faces as the teachers returned to work and were surprised with this offering. It takes a village to raise a child and I'm happy to say that One Church is part of our village. High five Franklin to how God will continue moving through your city as you pray for one. Up at number two, we're celebrating a Stephanie and what God is doing in her life. She's been attending our Bedford Outpost and recently she was baptized. It was a beautiful celebration of her faith in Jesus. Way to go, Stephanie. This high five goes out to you today. And finally, up at number one, Sandy attended our Manchester Outpost this past Sunday and found herself ready to respond to what God was calling her to do and be baptized. Sandy claims the truth that her identity is in Christ and we're all celebrating that with her today. High five, Sandy. Thanks for joining us for our high five and I can't wait to celebrate with you in the next one.